Hello friends, in this video tutorial, we are going to see the concept of transactions in SSIS. For this, let us add an execute SQL task. Let us establish connection to the database. Now using this first execute SQL task, let us insert a record for India in our country master table. Insert three more records in our country master table. Using the second execute SQL task. Let us insert a record for US. With the help of the third execute SQL task, let us insert a record for Australia. With the help of the fourth execute SQL task, let us insert a record for Japan. So let us check once again the SQL statements for all four tasks. Now, let us right click the package, go to its properties and let us set the transaction attribute to required. As we can see in our country master table, currently there are no records. Now let us introduce an error in the fourth task. So let us change the SQL statement for the fourth task and let us introduce an error. Let us execute our package and we can see that the first three insert statements had ran successfully whereas the fourth one gave error. And as we can see still there are no records in the database which means the all four insert statements have acted in a transaction, in a single transaction. Now let us correct our fourth SQL statement. Let us execute the package again. So this time all four insert statements have ran successfully and correspondingly in our database table we have four records. 
थैंक यू